There we go. Now I think I would add glitter. We'll go with the gold. And a little bit of gold in there. Oh no! Hey guys, it's Kayla from Rare Lucis, and today we are going to be doing the reverse slime challenge. And I've seen this on Instagram and I thought it looked kind of cool, but I've never done it before, so let's see how this goes. So basically, it's pretty straightforward. Activator first, food dyes, extra things like that, and then glue last, and then you just see how it turns out. First thing I'm gonna add is my saline solution, because usually when I make slime, I go baking soda first, then saline solution is very last. So we'll put saline solution in first. So let's add in kind of a lot because I don't want it to be under activated and I can always add more glue. Okay, that's probably good. And then I'll take like a little pinch of baking soda, like that. Maybe a little bit more. I'll put the rest in there. Gotta mix it all up until it dissolves maybe. So far so good, no explosions. Doing pretty good. There we go. Now, I think I wanna add some scents. So the one that I picked out was apple blossom. So I'm kind of going for like a flamingo, like flum maybe. I don't know, apple blossom is like kind of reminds me of like pink maybe. So I'm gonna put a little tiny drop of this in there. That's probably good. And then we'll just stir it all up. This smells really good by the way. I love this one. I have another one too. It's baked apple or something like that. And that one smells good. There we go. Now I think I would add glitter. We'll go with the gold. Gold in there. Oh no! Too much gold. <laughs> Mix up that first. Oh, it kind of looks like gold flakies. Oh, it's getting in the scent too, so it's making little gold like oil balls. Okay, see them on camera. At the bottom, there's like these little oil balls. That's the slime scent mixed with the glitter. <laughs> this time, I'm not going to stir it because the last time the gold got stuck in my spoon. So now we're just gonna move on, and I'm gonna do some food coloring. Flamingos are pink, so I'm gonna do some pink food dye. Just add a couple drops in there. so pretty you can't really see it because the gold is covering but it's like really pretty okay so let's mix this up oh can you see it can you see it mommy it's so pretty okay see what i mean like the gold is getting stuck to my spoon next we want foam so we're gonna add some foam balls a lot because we want this to be really crunchy oh yeah again i'm going for a flamingo theme if you missed it last time <laughs> so we're gonna make like a flamingo crunch i think that's what i want to call this oh you can see it's coming together Oh, I think this is gonna look really pretty. I'm kind of nervous that the gold isn't gonna show up because I can't go back and add more gold afterwards. At least I don't think I can. Is that breaking the rules? I think that's breaking the rules. <laughs> oh, I think this looks very flamingo-y. My mom said that I could probably get away with adding more gold because I haven't added glue yet. So technically we're still on extras and gold falls under the extras category. So a little bit more gold. Just a little bit <laughs> Oh, that we go. That's, that's better. That's way better. It kind of feels like, I don't know, it's not slimy. It kind of feels powdery. I don't know, it reminds me of like powder. Like I can pick this up and it's fine. It doesn't feel wet. Actually, kind of, some spots feel wet, but like if you touch the top, it doesn't really feel that wet. It's different than I thought it was going to be. That looks good, right? Yeah. Okay, so now we'll add some glue because that is our last item. And we'll add a little bit at a time because we want the activator to work still. See this, mommy? Oh my gosh. I need more. Oh my goodness. It's coming together. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh yay. I love it. Oh, it feels so good. Okay, wait. I still gotta massage it. Trust me on this. Trust me. Trust me. I got this. I got this. I'm not gonna touch that with my bare hands. Sorry. <laughs> It's feeling good, it's feeling good. Good, good. We're still massaging. It's not where I want it to be yet, but we're still working on it, so I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up, it's still good. It looks really pretty. Do you see that? Look at how shiny and pretty it is. I think it's pretty. It's very crunchy. It's coming together. Oh, it's coming together well. Let's grab all this extra stuff, because I want all of it. I want as much as possible. I don't know. It's kind of hard, I don't know. It's, uh, it's not as good as I thought it would turn out, but it's definitely not bad. And it turned out 
out really pretty too. It's not the best slime in the world, but it's not the worst slime I've ever made. The foam balls aren't really falling out. This is from making it. Okay, before, once I play with it, let's see if it gets worse. Okay, maybe a little bit. <laughs> I'm happy with how it looks. I don't know, it's really pretty, I like it. It's still stretchy, if that's good. Wait, let's see if I can make a slime swirl. That's like the ultimate test. Slime swirl. What do you think? Do you think that, that works? I don't know. How would you rate my slime swirl? One out of ten. <laughs> it looks like a ten to you? Yeah, I like it. Okay. It looks like a scarf that you would wear on your neck. You would wear this if it was a scarf? Yes. Okay. I think it's pretty. It's very moldable. Like if you wanted to make something, you could make something with this slime. See what we can make. Or maybe I can make a heart. Let's see if I can make a heart. Heart. Boom. See? Multiple. And then you stretch. I get the piggy, piggy, and perhaps I say <laughs> Comment down below whether you think I did good or not based on what you have seen. It smells really good. It smells like perfume and it looks really pretty. The slimy qualities. I think I can improve on, but it still does have slimy qualities. So, comment down below what you think about this slime. And yeah, so this is the end of the video. I think I did pretty good. Like, give a like on this video, and until next time.